Edomite is losing his mind. All praise is honor, glory goes to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakhakwadash. Double honors to the apostles, Elder Bishop, the Great Millstone, who rule well, peace and blessings to you, fellow brothers, pushing his word in truth and sincerity. Coming back with another lesson through the spirit and power, Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, Bashem, Rakhakwadash. And um, basically, the Edomite is is losing his mind, you know, because he he's feeling the 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 slip of power, right? And it, not only here in America, which he's complaining about the changing demographics, he's complaining about you know Black Lives Matter, and he's upset that he's being called a colonizer. He's being he's upset that he's being called racist and that he can't point out certain things um you know uh, against people of color particularly uh so-called negroes okay but hispanics and native americans you know um as well he's being he's being cursed out by these different nations so not only here in america but also in europe europe demographic has changed you have all all type of uh, heathens uh, flooding into Europe, uh, Northern Africa, uh, Africa, um, Asia. Okay, because their countries are all messed up. Um, West Africa, right, going into France, going into Italy, going into Spain. You know, and it's and it's messing up the Edomites. Um, you know their their the quality of life because for a while the Edomite was doing great. Let me bring out a scripture. Give me a second. It's not going to be long. This uh, video I'm gonna try to put the uh, the video in uh, if I remember in the description box. Give me a second. It's in Lamentations is inspired. I was just kind of listening to some videos. I was um, listening to this video with Tucker, 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 excuse me, Tucker Carlson, and all it, all the video is is just complaining about how America is is jacked up. This is why so many Edomites they they uh, align themselves with Trump. Because Trump is about, I love my country, you know, let's make America great again. The Edomites, they, you know, they hear, the, the younger generation, they hear from their grandfathers, your great grandfather, they're still alive, how great America was. And, and how they, you know, they were the, you know, they, they were the top nation in the earth. Everybody respected them. The American dollar is stretched. You know, you can take care of your your family with one. Uh, give me a second. I'm just getting this with one income. But now see all the, the Mexicans, they taking the jobs and the blacks, they're, you know, them and their 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 sagging pants and they're just breaking in in stores and stealing things. They're messing it up for everybody. They, they messed up America. Lamentation. Four and 21 rejoice and be glad O daughter of Edom right right now really you should be rejoicing what's that rejoicing you're not you're, you're not really rejoicing uh, like you used to right your daughter she she doesn't even want to deal with the Edomite man no more your son your son wants to uh, be a rapper okay they follow and after Jake Right, you don't you you don't have that clout like you used to. You 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 know you look you look down upon by these other nations when you go to Asia. I mean, he, Esau is still on top. Don't get it twisted. But he's he he's losing his mind because he actually is feeling the slip of power. Right, he's actually feeling it, and he's hearing it also. You know, um, 
in these different, uh, uh, me, you know, d- different media platforms, different uh, influencers. Everybody is against the Edomite for what they're doing, especially the, especially the small hat. They can't deceive the people like they used to. People are starting to become hip to the tactics of Esau Edom. Start, and it all started with the Most High putting the spirit back upon the Israelites. Okay, and the prophets, the prophesied. That's that's where it all started. Esau started to go down. It tells you that in uh, Obadiah, when he set his nest amongst the stars, then will the Heavenly Father bring him down. So he's being brought down, and he feels it. And he's, and he's going to go mad in these last days. He's going to come heavily upon you you uh, so-called black Hispanic Native Americans. Okay? He's going to try to literally depop- depopulate you. Okay? He's going to blame you for the reason why the country is all messed up. He wants to go back to the good old days. You know, the good old boys. Where he had his, his, his foot on your neck he had complete control and dominion over you so called black Hispanic Native Americans that's when he was in his pomp that's when he was that's when he was in his glory that dwellers in the land of Uz the cup also shall be passed through unto thee and he's hearing this don't get it twisted he's hearing what we're saying it tells us in Revelation that great fear uh, I believe that's Revelation 11 Great fear fell upon them. Let, let me get that. We experienced that at camp the other uh, the other day. Okay, these nations are afraid. Okay, they're afraid of what's coming because as we say, you know, they they don't believe us, right? But in the back of their mind, in their inner spirit, right, they know it to be true because meanwhile while we're saying this the things that we're saying is actually happening the collapse of the western world okay these other dark nations okay all of Asia all of Africa the different islands right the different they're, they're taking up a stand against the, the so-called white man the, the, the so-called white man is not being looked at in a good light anymore okay this is revelation 11 and 12 and they heard a great voice uh no no no, no. right verse uh, 11 and 11 and after three days and a half the spirit of the most high entered into them that was after that's the 350 years from 1620 to 1970 and that's when Esau started to go down was in the late uh, the late uh, 60s when he went into uh, space was that 1969 when he so called went to the moon but he was going into the upper atmosphere a little bit before that you know and then he just boasted himself which was, that was a Hollywood production him going to the, uh, to the moon he never been to the moon but that's when he started to go down, and that's when the spirit of the Most High started to enter into us. Okay, via via the word. Okay, going out, and the Israelites waking up, the Great Awakening. Okay, it says, and they stood upon their feet. Now we're on our feet, and great fear fell upon them which saw them. So. They're hearing of um, what you know the, the the different things that we're saying. Isaiah it talks about shake the hand that they may go into the gates of the nobles, and the wicked elite which deal with uh, uh you know they deal with left hand energy and and and, and spirit you know spiritual wickedness high they under they understand what's going on, they know what's going on. They have their scholars. They know that they actually know that we're the Israelites. They know that the Israelites ruled, okay, and that the world is actually um, promised to the Israelites. That's why they try to say that they're the that they're that they're the, the people. Okay, so the point was there. They have uh, uh, fear is falling upon them. Okay, 
And Esau, Esau's mad. And then he's mad not only at Jake, but he's also mad at the globalist, the, the elite, the, the so-called deep state. OK, because, you know, they're not getting a piece of the pie. They will be OK with the whole put the whole uh, put all these other nations in slavery. But see, the global, the, the, the small head wants to put their ass in slavery, too. So their rights are being taken from America. You got all these immigrants coming in. You got all these uh, government programs propping, you know, these 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 uh, people coming in from El Salvador and, and Esau. He he's starting to you know, this woman divorcing them and going getting with a big black man and a Latino man. OK. He, he doesn't have control over his family anymore. He can't be a blatant racist anymore. So he's upset. And he he's he, he's getting ready to fight not only Jake, but also the globalists. Well, in, in certain pockets, Esau, he said, we got to come together. He's telling Jake, we got to come together. It's, it's not they're trying to they're trying to divide us. Right. They're trying they're trying to divide us. We need to we need to come together. Give me a second. Okay. Just give me a second slot in. They trying to divide us. We need to come together. You know, it's it's not a you know, we gotta fight, we gotta fight the uh the, the, the globalists. They're trying to put us in slavery. Yeah, because the the small is trying to put everybody in slavery. Okay? And this dude is getting ready to be in a drunken rage. The regular Edomite and the 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 the, the head of the Edomites, Amalek. He he's afraid as well. And and, and that's why it speaks about that in um Revelation twelve. How He's going to come down upon the earth because he know if he has a short time. I'm back in uh, Lamentations, but um, give me one moment. Back in Lamentations, Lamentations 4 and 21. Rejoice and be glad, O daughter of Edom that dwelleth in the land of Uz. The cup also shall be passed unto thee. Thou shalt be drunk, thou shalt be drunken, and thou shalt make thyself naked. The punishment of thy iniquities is accomplished. Right? The most high, he he's taking away our captivity. He's pulling back our captivity, and he's getting ready to present you with your captivity. J just like when we before we went into captivity, it was told unto us that we was gonna go into captivity. The most high raised up prophets. Okay? And Jake, for the most part, Jake really Jake didn't listen. And the same thing, Esau Edom, he's not listening. He ain't repenting, neither can he repent. He ain't set up for him to repent. Okay? He's he's set up to uh to go down. Okay. He said he set up to go down. OK. He ain't he ain't he ain't set up to make it. Rejoice and be glad, O daughter of Edom, that dwelleth in the land of Uz. The cup also shall be passed. Right. Yeah, it's like I read that the punishment of thy iniquity is accomplished. O daughter of Zion, he will no more carry thee away into captivity. He will visit thy iniquity, O daughter of Edom. He will discover thy sins. See? And this is what's happening. This is why he's being reproached. Th this is why he's he's lo he's losing his mind. Tucker Carlson, he's losing his mind. And he and Tucker Carlson, he he actually visited the camp. The apostles. Okay? So he he knows the deal. Okay, where am I? 
to lock in. Tucker Carlson, he know he knows the deal. Okay. Um, was it another scripture? Um, I think it might have been another scripture. Please bear with me. That might have been it. Okay, yeah, one more. Give me a second. Let me just, I'm just parking this car. Give me a second. I believe that's Isaiah. Oh, there's a couple of, uh, let me see. Right there we go. Okay, that it was it was just Jeremiah. Jeremiah forty nine and twelve. For thus said the Lord, Behold, they who judgment was not to drink of the cup have a surely drunken, and art thou he that shall altogether go unpunished? Thou shalt not go unpunished, but thou shalt surely drink of it. Right? You gonna you gonna drink of this cup, Esau? You not gonna get away with? The crimes against humanity, the crimes against the Israelites, you're going to actually experience the judgment. And, and, and now you're upset. Of course, I would be, too. But you got to you got to deal with it. So we're going to see Esau absolutely lose his mind as he's already losing his mind. He's going to go crazy. He's going to go mad. He's going to be in that drunken rage. OK, verse 13. For I have sworn by myself, said the Lord. And he hates that we're actually standing with great boldness, okay, basically saying, hey, look, Esau, okay, you're you going to be destroyed, okay? That Basra shall be a desolation, a reproach, a waste, a curse, and all the cities shall be a perpetual waste, okay? So, you know, that, that was pretty much it on that. was a little just quick lesson. I'm going to try to put that up. Uh, that clip in there as well you could take it out you could you know you could you could check it out um you know he's just talk he just talking about the the, the declining america uh, declining america and he's and, and esau here in america is hurt okay uh colonel douglas mcgregor he hurt scott ritter he hurt all these edomites that see the, they actually see the writing on the wall they hurt okay that their baby is 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 gone until next time shall want to elect